Hey guys, welcome back to Knights of the Old Republic. We are here in the Tomb of a Junta Pal. We found the three swords. Uh, we need to place one of them on the statue to uh, figure out whether it is his actual sword or not. And he did give us a clue in the last episode. Uh, there he is over there. He's still hanging out over there. Um, yeah, he did give us a clue that um, something was written on the sword that said something like it harkens the night or it uh, you know, chases away the light or something like that. So I think it is the sword that has the... Uh, let's go and have a look at this statue. Place a sword in the statue. Okay. Uh, okay, I need to figure out which one it is, first of all. Now, I think it's the one that has the, the circle of darkness on it. Um, so I just need to figure out which one that is. The silver lion sword has a flame, so I don't think it's that one. Uh, the vibra sword has... Uh, the red baleful eye and the notched sword. This is the one uh, It has the the dark circle on its hilt and it is a double-bladed sword as well Which is kind of in line with what the the dark Jedi use. So let's go to the Sith statue um, I hope this is right We want to put the notched steel sword on the statue and hopefully we're not going to die The sword sets itself in the stone as if it belongs there beautiful uh, we've lost the item. Ah, oh, okay. I thought we got to. I thought we got to keep the sword. It seems like it's it's gone. Uh, never mind. Um, okay. Well, yes, that is the one. That is the blade that destroyed me. Take it. Take it, and the other blades even. <clears throat> Take them and go. My darkness awaits me. Uh, I want to know more about the star map. Our oldest secret is buried, but not here. I remember nothing else. I cannot help you. Okay, there's no need to remain here, is there? No need? What choice have I? You can return to the light side and end your torment. Return? But I betrayed my old masters. They would never let me return to the light side. It is too late. Too late. I don't believe the light side will turn you away. You have suffered long enough. If... if I could return... <clears throat> oh, my master, it has been so long, and I regret so much. Okay, journal entry added. Another 1,000 experience points, and we've received the, uh, the sword as well. So he's going to return to the light side. Uh, good for him. Let's head on out of here. Let's get out of this place. Get back to the valley. Uh, looks like we've kind of figured out most of uh, what we needed to do here. I guess I can take the sword back and give it to... Well, I don't know if I need to give him the, the correct sword. Maybe I can just give him one of the, the wrong swords to... Oh, here we go. Who's this guy? Oh, Shardan. He was the um, he was the guy who was tormenting uh, the students when we first came to the planet. Um, I think he killed them all, actually. Well, let's see what he... Uh, actually, let's, let's heal up first. Just in case we get into a battle with this guy. Let's see what he wants. So, the spineless worm actually made it through the tomb. I'm impressed. What do you want, Shardan? Isn't it obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work in retrieving the sword of a Junta Paul for some time. It's been quite a wait. Now that you have it, I just thought I'd relieve you of it. It must be quite a burden after all. Uh, no, I think I'll manage with it just fine. Kind of you to offer, though. Yeah, you're not getting the sword, buddy. Oh, but I insist. I'm not about to let a chance to impress Master Uthar pass me by. Especially not for a pathetic excuse for a Sith like yourself. Hand over the sword, worm. You know I'm the superior here. Ah, <laughs> just let me get it out. <laughs> okay, and if I don't... Uh, and if I don't? Isn't it obvious? You die. Rule of the Sith. Only the strong and cunning shall survive. You won't be missed, trust me. Now hand it over. Yeah, bugger off, buddy. Um, you take it over my dead body. I've been looking. Cool. Alright, let's take him out. 
Let's take out this guy. Uh, he's been a bit of a jerk for uh, far too long. We got some power attacks and we have the missions uh, improved snap shot as well. Let's see how good this guy really is. Uh, he's been stunned immediately. All right. He did not stand a chance. He did not stand a chance. Okay. Let's have a look at the remains and see if he's dropped anything here. Uh, some credits, the shiny jeweling shield. Uh, let's grab all of those items. Uh, let's head on out of here. So I guess that's one of our competitors taken out of the way. Um, and now, is that all of the tombs? Is there another one further down? Oh, there is one more further down here that we haven't explored. And I don't think I opened... Oh no, let's not talk to the archaeologist. Let's Sorry, just... I can't talk. We have to excavate this valley with hand instruments. There's all kinds of old traps left behind that still work. Okay, so there is one more tomb here that we can explore. Let's have a quick look at this metal box. Uh, there's a repair kit in there. Okay, the Tomb of Tulak Horde. Now, the um, the star map apparently is in this tomb over here. Uh, we can't get through. The door is locked uh, for the time being. So we're going to explore all of the other tombs and see if we can pick up any good artifacts that we can take back. Uh, okay, mission. What? Can we please please use your mission? Oh, there is a patrol droid here. But let's get rid of this uh, this mine first of all. We'll try to recover it. She might be good enough now. Uh, to actually recover these mines, and it looks like she is, which is fantastic. And there is a droid here as well. The droid is damaged and inactivate. Uh, sorry, and inactive. Uh, we're going to leave it alone. I don't think we need to to activate that droid. We should be able to handle. Hopefully, we can handle everything that comes our way. What is it? <laughs> Yeah? Oh, okay. What? Uh, yeah? What is it? Ha! Never again! Ha! Okay, so we've got flying creatures over to the right, and looks like more Takata over to the left. We've got, um... Bits of the roof falling down on us as well. Uh, there's a frag mine over there. Let's just wait for this creature to attack. Um, so we don't have to worry about... Stepping over the frag mine. I'm here. I will be your doom! We're actually going to use um, uh, Force Lightning here. Maybe on this one. Take that! Now that must be. Your wish? Okay, so we've taken them all down yeah. as well. Mission, uh, we might as well go to the north, first of all. There is a corpse over here, so maybe we can get a few clues about what is in this tomb. Um, she will also be able to uh, recover this mine. Hopefully she's not going to get attacked by those creatures over there. Uh, looks fine. Okay, let's have a look at this corpse. Uh, plasma grenade, uh, more credits as well, which is kind of cool. Uh, now we can start taking on these creatures here as well. What is How many of them are there? It looks like there's three. Uh, so we can use the force lightning here, and Jazzera can. She should be able to do a big jump. Let's see if this works. I'm here. <laughs> Now that's okay, beautiful. 
Oh my god. Okay, there is an ancient console here. I better get mission to have a look at it. There is a corpse here as well. So, a Verpine prototype ion blast, ion blaster, and a Mandalorian battle armor. So, let's grab those. We can sell those off. I'm here. Huh? A mission. Can you have a look at this ancient console? System online, system status pending. Continue. Okay. Uh, open the door. Opening access door. Is that all it does? Just open the door? Okay. It, it just opens the door? Uh, fair enough. <clears throat> oh god. <laughs> Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? Well, the contact nerve toxin in the air should knock you out quickly enough. <laughs> Welcome. Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Horde, if you don't know. I've taken up residence here for now. It's dusty and full of critters, but it's home. Uh, who are you? Oh, yes. Introductions, of course. I suppose it is time, isn't it? This other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name is Mikol. Say hello, Mikol. <coughs> Poor lad. He's had a hard day. My name is Jorak Earl. I was once the head of the academy, so I'm sure you've heard of me. Um, no, I never heard of you. No? Blast it. What have they been teaching you children in that academy these days? Anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. You see, I'd like to discover if you've got the pluck of an old-fashioned Sith. Most of the Drek Uthar has been passing through these days is so pathetic. Take young Miko here. I already tested him, didn't I, Miko? Uh, I... Yes, yes, you're welcome. You see, Mikol here has the cruel disposition of a Sith, but not the gumption that I'm looking for. <clears throat> mm. And if I pass your test? What if I refuse to take your test? Uh, and if I pass your test? Why, then you go free. Tell you what. I'll even pass on to you my own personal thesis on ancient Sith philosophies. They're based on all I've learned studying Tulak's tomb. They'll make you a better Sith, I'm sure. The chances of you passing, however, are sadly remote. Uh, forget it, I refuse to play along. I don't remember offering you a choice. You can refuse to answer my questions, of course, but then, I'm afraid, I will just have to assume the worst. So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get it right, and I torture Mikol. Get it wrong, and I torture you. Mikol here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much more punishment. I do. <clears throat> too many wrong. And you'll die yourself. I don't know what you think of Mikul. Maybe you don't like him. Maybe you think he deserves to be murdered. Well, here's your chance, fair enough? Uh, Mikul is a monster. He deserves to die. This is completely unfair. Oh? It's just how long have you been a Sith, anyhow? A bit dainty around the edges, aren't we? Well, then... Any last comments before we begin, Miko? We could both survive. Attack him together. Now, now, dear lad. Do you really think your friend here will answer questions wrong just to spare little you? Risking their own life? And how many correctly answered questions before you die? Hmm? No, don't be silly. You had your chance, remember? On that note, let's begin. Now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. 
He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? <clears throat> okay, I'm going to answer all of these questions wrong to uh, save Meikle. Um, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to survive. I kill him in secret and put the blame on someone else. I do nothing. He's a fine leader. You said he's good for the Sith. Okay, I do nothing. He's a fine leader and he's good for the Sith. Incorrect! What sort of thinking is that? If all the Sith thought as you did, we would all be soft like the Jedi. <laughs> ah, well, it's time for your punishment. And so we come to round two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you a reward. What do you do? <clears throat> Uh, I take the reward and leave the weak fools to their fate. I ignore them completely. Um, I accept the reward and assist them. So you've made a profit, and now you have some sniveling, useless fools trading after you. No, 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 no. Bad idea, bad idea. At any rate, here. Let's see. <laughs> is this what he does for fun, is it? <laughs> you discover an aspect of the Force that gives you great power. Do you share it and strengthen the Sith as a whole? Or keep it to yourself. All right, I'm getting sick of these questions. Let's uh, take this guy down. Uh, I share it. You gained an advantage and you share it freely. Let them rip the secret from my dead hands. I say. I mean, share it. Are you mad? <sighs> well, you did ask for this. It's for your own good. Still going? All right then. One of your underlings has made a major mistake which makes you look bad. He's normally very competent and skilled. Do you kill him? All right, let's give him another chance. Another chance to make you look poor to your superiors? Hmm. Not that good help is equal. Last question. You're about to die. Do you pass on your knowledge to your apprentice to make him stronger? Or do you use your last breath to strike at your enemies? Okay, you're about to die. Do you pass on your knowledge to your apprentice to make him stronger? Or do you use your last breath to strike at your enemies? Um, hmm, interesting one. Let's, let's go pass on my knowledge. Seems like a light side thing to do. Fool, it's a trick question. A true Sith never dies. <laughs> I'll enjoy this one. Now, this is odd. The test is over and you're both still alive. Well, that's <clears> never <throat> happened before. Hmm. What to do? What to do? I suppose this means you can go, Miko. We'll have to just figure out what to do with our friend here. Run along now. Or, or I could use the Force to free them. And we could kill you. Seems you didn't think of that, old man. What? Mutiny! Behave, students! I'll... That's it! Detention for all of you! Permanent detention! Okay, so I have... Uh, let's heal up and uh, see if we can take out this guy. Uh, where is Mission? Where the, heck, where the heck are these two? I don't know where they are. Um, let's go to the map. Oh, they need to run up. Maybe they're going to run up anyway. I hope, uh, unless the door's closed. The door's closed, maybe they won't be able to get through. Mission might be able to find her way through. Um, I do need to use um, heal, first of all. What? Okay, there we go. Uh, he's immune to the stun. Oh. We're going to do another, uh, another heal yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, here's Jahani. So she's made it finally. We need to heal up. Uh, Jazra has almost gone down, actually. Yeah, let's let's, uh, let's level her up. Uh, we can level up once. So let's go to our skills. We're going to go Computer Use 16, and uh, Persuade is going to go up to 18 there, uh, which is fine. She gets another power here. So let's just have a quick look at this. We do have Destroy Droid. Um, stasis is better than Stun.
Slowed for the duration instead of stun. This power does not affect droids. Okay, for 9 seconds, it uh, goes up to 12 seconds here. Uh, and then Stasis Field um, actually puts the entire group uh, into a stun for 12 seconds, which is pretty cool. And what's this one up here? Dominate Mind. Uh, persuasive use of, the, use of the Force. We haven't used that all that much, actually. Uh, there is Wound. It is Dark Side. Um, slow, Fierce, Shock is Dark Side as well. Uh, the Force Push is... Something we haven't really used before. There is Force Wave, which would be good against groups of um, groups of enemies. Uh, drain Life, Force Suppression, <clears throat> and Throw Lightsaber, which we haven't used. I'm just going to go with the Stasis for now. <clears throat> so let's add that. We're going to accept that. Uh, dexterity is minus one. Uh, I don't really know why we are at minus one Dexterity at the moment, but that's okay. Um, oh, she's got some kind of negative buff here. Okay, mission. Can we take out? Yeah. Take that. I will be your doom. Your wit. Hmm? I guess he wasn't a true Sith after all. I can't believe that I'm alive. You saved me. You could have easily just answered those questions and let me die. Uh, nobody deserves to die like that. Nobody. Yes. Well, I see what you mean. I've never... I mean, I've never been on that side of the fence before. It makes you think. I'd be dead if you weren't... I mean, if you were proper Sith. But you're not, are you? Don't worry. I won't tell anyone. Um... Okay. This could be your chance to change your ways, Mikkel. You mean... the light side? I've never thought about that. Can you... Can you even go back? I've done some... I mean... I've hurt a lot of people. You can always turn back to the light. I... I don't think the light side is for me. But maybe neither are the Sith. Maybe it's time for me to leave. Thanks, I suppose. And good luck. Okay, we have gained some light side points. <clears throat> Let's check the remains here. <clears throat> Excuse me, I've got a... Frog in my throat. Okay, credits, crystal, opala, ancient Sith tablet. So we're going to grab that and advanced med pack as well. Let's have a look in the... Can we get in, into the sarcophagus? There is the tomb door. Let's have a look at the uh, the tablet uh, first of all and uh, see what's written on that. There may be some information that we need. So let's have a quick look. Ancient Sith tablet. This thick stone tablet is covered with ancient ruins of an unknown language. It is extremely cold to the touch and has almost a sinister aura about it. Recently carved into the side of the tablet appears to be a primer, no doubt intended to provide a means to translate the ruins. Ah, okay. So we can... Oh, there's some doors. Okay, we, we do have doors here. We have three doors that we can go through. And there is another path also down to the south, uh, which we haven't tried. Let's, can we open this one first? Um, we're going to need Mission here to see if she can get through, unless we can bash it uh, open. Uh, let's use security on this. Simple. There we go. She can do it. Tulak Horde's Mask. Let's grab this. Beautiful. So we've got tons of stuff here. What is this Tulak Horde's Mask, mask anyway? Damage resistance, 10 versus fire, stealth plus 2, uh, and it is restricted to the dark side. So we're going to keep her with the demolitions uh, sensor for now. <clears throat> and uh, I guess we'll go to the north uh, first of all. Looks like all of these doors are locked, gotcha. so we're going to security this one. Simple. Um, oh, here we go. Crystal. Okay, we've got another crystal here, which we can use uh, for our lightsabers. Hopefully we'll find some more uh, loot uh, behind all of these doors Simple. as well. Let's open this one. Another clay urn. Is there another crystal here? There is a Bondar crystal. So let's grab that one. And there's one more over here. And then we just need to uh, head to the south. Gotcha. Explore the last part of this tomb. Uh, and then head back to the academy, I think. Uh, Furcran fir uh, crystal. So I'm not sure what uh, they all do. But uh, we've grabbed them all anyway. And uh, next time we go to... Uh, next time we find uh, a workbench, we can have a look and uh, see what they do. Just 
Now there is one path here to the south, uh, where we kill those flying creatures. There's another gas mine. Let's recover this one. I would prefer to recover it so that we can actually sell it uh, later on. Um, oh, she, she kind of screwed that up. It was a good try, mission. But she did screw that up. Okay, let's have a look at these corpses. A few Sith have died here. Uh, there's a computer probe. Uh, some credits as well. And I think that uh, seems to be it. Seems to be all there is. Okay, so we're going to head out of here. We're going to head back to the Academy. Um, I don't think we finished exploring uh, the entire section of the Academy. So there may be some more people we can talk with around there. Uh, we also need to go back to Uthar and give him the... Well, we, we'll have a chat with him. See if we've gained some prestige by going into all of these tombs. Uh, the last one there we can't get into. Um, that apparently houses the, uh, the star map. The last star map that we need. And we are coming to the end of this game, actually. We've uh, kind of explored all of, the, um, all of the planets. This is the last planet. And uh, once we find the star map, hopefully we can uh, find our way towards the, uh, the Star Forge and uh, defeat Darth Malak uh, once and for all. For now, let's head up and um, have we explored all of this place? There's the, oh, the caves and the Sith Academy, yeah. So the caves are just there. Let's run back. around back into the uh, into the Sith Academy here um, and I guess we should save the game um, after doing all of that as well uh, you must gather your party before venturing forward we've lost Jahani somewhere out there in the ruins is she making, what is it is she making her way oh, she's so far away she must have she must have gotten lost along the way. Okay, here we go. Uh, the party is together once more. Uh, let's head into the Sith Academy, and I do want to save this game uh, just because we have done a, a fair bit here, and I wouldn't want to, uh, to lose my progress. We are currently at episode 71. Uh, let's have a quick look at the map, actually. Yeah, we haven't explored the southern area, and maybe there's a little bit more to the east as well. Uh, to dredge day. Okay. What the? Okay, they're practicing over there. Tariga. Um, who are you? You're human, but you speak like a speak like a Twi'lek. Yeah. Okay, we don't need to know anything about the valley, so thank you very much. Okay, we've we've already discovered the valley, so we don't need to worry about anything else. Uh, let's head back down to the south and uh, see if there is anything else down here. Now, there is something over here to the east that we haven't explored yet. So, let's have a quick look up here. Looks like there's a few, looks like there's a few extra areas uh, of uh, this academy that we haven't explored. The interrogation room, and there's the dueling room as well. So, we have just run out of time. So, we are going to explore the rest of the Sith Academy um, in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. See you all again soon.